All right. Listen up. I just finished Type Zero today. Final Fantasy Type Zero, which was a PSP game. Uh, really shows. But I played it on uh, the good old-fashioned Xbox One because I have nothing else to do. <sighs> Dude, the ending. The ending is so bad. Like, I think it rivals Final Fantasy XIII in terms of god-awful endings. Because holy sugar cookies, man. Like, my goodness. So, pretty much, <laughs> Class Zero, the main cast, they go to the final boss, man. And they're about to die, and it's all tragic. And then the two other members of Class Zero, Machina and Rem, they kill each other. Or Machina kills Rem and then kills himself because he's all sad. And he's like, Crawl! Then he just kills himself. And then... <laughs> They're just these big ass crystals. And then Class Zero just walks up and they're like, oh, Final Boss Man, we're here to beat you. And Final Boss Man's like, no, you're not going to do that. And then they duke it out and Class Zero's all banked as shit, so they just die. And then Machina and Rem just shoot their souls out of their crystal bodies to revive all of Class Zero to kill them. And then Class Zero kills him. And even though they became, like, supercharged by, like, awesome god souls, they just go home and they're gonna die. And then it gets really depressing for a minute, and then, like, it's just the dumbest thing ever. They just all die. Everything is for nothing. The world is done. Everybody is dead. And then Class Zero just goes home and they're like, you know what, we're just gonna talk about our future plans and we're just gonna die. Oh my god. Why'd you message me, Gabe? No. No, I'm I'm just gonna go until I'm done. Oh my goodness. Then, like, Ace just, like, sings a song that's super dumb, and everyone's like, Oh, Ace, why'd you sing the song? He's And King's like, Oh, he doesn't know the rest, so he only sings that much. And it, friggin' everybody's like, Oh, it's symbolic! Blah, blah, blah. Oh! And... Meanwhile, Nomura is just rolling over in his grave, and, oh my god, it, it's just one of the worst endings, to, not even to a Final Fantasy, to, like, anything, because, like, in the end, it's for nothing, because Class Zero dies, and the credits roll, and then, like, <laughs> five minutes after the credits start, it just goes to this cutscene where Machina and Rem come home, out of crystals, and having, like, foot long holes in between themselves like in their stomachs because rem has this huge ass sword so he just like killed them both and they come home despite being like stabbed through the stomach and then frozen in a crystal and then they see class zero and they're all dead and then it just cuts away and then it's like oh the world went to shit after the world went to shit big surprise and then <laughs> it just goes on to describe how machina just unites everybody. This unlikable character who, out the, who throughout the entire game is just a massive asshole and just ruins everything. He pretty much tries to kill everybody. He's acting as a double agent. He almost kills Class Zero multiple times. And then in the end, they're like, oh no, he's a good guy now because he was just sad. And he w tried to kill the protagonist because he was sad. And now he's a good guy. So now he unified all the people, and now they're all cool guys again, and now the world's dead. But hey, Machina became the king, and now the world's not dead. Oh, oh, wow, that sure is neato. They really just lost all subtlety by naming the character Machina in the first place. I figured by the end of the game they were going to pull some deus ex machina bullshit with them, and I wasn't disappointed uh, Final Fantasy Type-0, don't buy it, thank you, bye, I'm done.